Welcome back to the series, Teaching in the 21st Century. Today's topic, Collaboration. Have you ever been in a situation where your views and interpretations of the information are so different from someone else's, but you are still required to work alongside that person in a group project or assignment? While well, people are faced with the same situation on a day-to-day -day basis where they are required to play well with others, that's when the skill of collaboration comes into play. So to begin, let's define what collaboration means in simple terms, why collaboration is so important, and how we can get our students to collaborate more in the classroom. Collaboration is the ability to share ideas and thoughts openly alongside another person and to come up with a combined answer, response, and or solution about a particular topic or issue. It is the ability to combine different notions, beliefs, and theories into one concrete explanation and or solution that is reflective of the diversity of the group itself. Cooperative learning is a key aspect to collaboration. It is the ability to work with more than one person toward a desired goal. It is the idea of working together or teamwork towards something that cannot be achieved on one's own. So why is there so much weight placed on collaboration? We are surrounded by thousands of people all with differing perspectives and standpoints on various topics and subject matters. So what happens when you are placed in a position with someone of opposing viewpoints? As you know, the situation can get tenuous. But if the person knows how to deal with the situation and has the ability to collaborate, join forces, and pool resources together, the person has an easier time integrating and understanding the other person's position and therefore allowing both individuals the ability to voice their opinions and openly work together towards a common goal. To take it a little further, the idea behind collaboration is giving a person the ability to view information from many angles allowing them to see or understand something that was not recognized before. Knowing how to collaborate establishes a foundation for more than just one skill. It plays on skills such as communication, time management, problem solving, resource allocation, and many more. The benefits of collaboration are endless. Join us on part two as we look at how to get our students to collaborate more in the classroom.